Hi, I'm Mary Beth Shaw, the owner and founder of Stencil Girl Products. I'm so happy you're interested in my collage papers. They're so much fun for me to paint. I enjoy doing it, um, painting papers using a gel plate or just direct painting to paper. Of course you know I use stencils and I love to incorporate a lot of different techniques to get interesting effects. The kind of effects where people can't really figure out how you did it exactly, that's the kind of thing I like. So anyway, one of my very, very favorite things is to utilize my collage papers like I've just given to you and print them on tissue so that I can get yet another intriguing result when I use them in collage. So I'm gonna show you how I do that, and um, but first I'm gonna show you what they look like when they're printed out on tissue. This is one of the sheets that, um, that I gave to you, and look at how cool it is on tissue. I mean, it's fantastic as is, but on tissue it's even better. And then this is another one that just came off the printer. And it's a simple, simple process to do. Basically, I use one kind of tissue. It's called Lineco, L-I-N-E-C-O. And it comes in eight and a half by 11 sheets. So here's a piece of the plain tissue, which is pretty cool. And then here is one that has been attached to a feeder sheet, which is really just a piece of copy paper. And so then that way it went through my printer. Now, I am not an expert on printers. I have a brother printer at home. I have an Epson printer here at the studio. Both of them work for this technique. Um, I don't know, you'll have to try it on your own printer. I am not responsible for what may happen. I personally haven't had a problem, I'm just saying. So, okay, this one that just came off the printer. What I did was, I took a piece of copy paper and then I used a glue stick and did the top and both sides and glued the plain tissue to the copy paper and then I put it into my printer and then I hit print and it just went right through. I have found it works better if there's no other paper in the paper tray. So it's the only piece of paper going through there. And I watch it closely in case it jams up or something happens, I'm right there to jump into it. But then you can just peel it away. and your edges get a little messy, but that's okay with me. And again, a fantastic piece of collage paper. At least I think so. These are the ones that I get really excited about using in my work, and I'm happy to share them with you. I hope you enjoy using these collage papers as much as I do, and I hope it inspires you to make some collage papers of your own, because I think that there's just nothing more fun than putting your own personal work into your art. Thanks so much for being a fan of Stencil Girl products.